Hello everyone, my name is Jonathan Kohler, the Agent of Enigmas, and welcome to week 27 of my show, A Deck of Tricks, my 52-week magic challenge. I have a fun trick for y'all today. So this past weekend was the 4th of July, and I got a chance to spend the holiday with my girlfriend Molly's family out in Michigan. While I was there, I was able to try out a brand new trick and thought that I would share it with you all today. So without any further ado, I give you ID Squared. So uh, for this, that I'm going to give you the choice. If you want to, you can either use A, my dice, or you can use my invisible dice. What? What would you like to use? Invisible dice. <laughs> okay, you get the invisible dice. Oh. Want to take a look at them, make sure that they're not weighted or loaded or anything? Yeah. As you can see clearly. Hefty. There's a joke in there. <laughs> 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 All right, and uh, I would like you to do me a favor. Uh, I would like you to take those dice and I'd like you to give them a roll. Yahtzee! Oh. Excellent. Okay. So, you see uh, two numbers on the top right there, yes? I do. Okay. I would like you to take one of those numbers and I would like you to double it. After you double it, I would like you to add five. After you add five, I would like you to times it by five. <laughs> 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 For human error, right. or error. <laughs> after you times it by five, I would like you to add the value of the other die that you did not use. Mm, okay. okay. The other invisible die. Yeah. So now you should have some weird random number in your head right now. Right? Yes. All right. I did my math correctly. <laughs> what is this weird random number? Eighty-seven. Eighty-seven. Interesting. Okay. Now, for you, you understand how you got to that number. But for me, mm -hmm. I have no idea. So uh, I'm going to ask you a couple questions just to kind of get in your head a little bit so I can understand your thought process. So then that way, hopefully, I can determine how you got to 87. Okay? So. Uh, um. If you were to have dessert, cake or ice cream? Ice cream. Ice cream. Uh, chocolate or not? Chocolate. Chocolate. <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> All right. Um, chocolate or something else? Um, let's see here, uh, M&M's or Reese's Pieces? M&M's. M&M's, okay. Um, Jimmy's or Sprinkles? Sprinkles. Um, whipped cream or no? Whipped cream. Okay. Um, let's see here. Cherries or strawberries? Cherries. Cherries. Excellent. And, um, okay, finally, uh, who's the better captain? Kirk or Picard? Ooh. Kirk. <laughs> yeah. Okay, you know what? That tells me exactly what I need to know. Okay, so. I don't really know how, but okay. Shoot, that's okay. Okay, we can for it. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, you have the number 87. Yeah. And uh, I think I got it. And from what the answers that you gave me, this is what I got. Now I know that it looks like just a big jumble of numbers, but actually if you know how to read it correctly, it makes sense. So for instance, uh, you said 87, right? So we got four, uh, five and four, that's nine, plus 11 is 20, plus 42 is 62. 62, sorry, that's not. 47. Okay, sorry, hold on, let me try it again. Um, uh, we got uh, 12 and 1 is 13, and 7 is 20, and 42, uh, that, that's 62, that's not, I'm, I'm sorry, okay, sorry, let me try one more time. Um, so we have 6 and 4, that's 10, that's 19, and 43 is 62. That's really weird, you know, I keep doing this, and I keep coming up with the number 62. Does this 62 have any kind of significance? <laughs> oh, wait a minute. <laughs> It's 
actually six and two. Oh my god! <laughs> Which were the numbers that you rolled on your dice. And not only that, you started with a six. Now, do you know how I uh, knew that? I will let you in on a little bit of this. You know, I have no are... idea, man. He loves the dice sitting at the table. I've been staring at them the entire time. <laughs> Actually, what's really fun, you can, you can double check my math with this. Uh, you will get 62 any way you do this. You can go uh, the column, or excuse me, the rows, excuse me, rows, there we go, columns. Uh, you can do the diagonals. Uh, you can do the center for it. You can do this quadrant, this quadrant, this wow. quadrant, this quadrant. Uh, you can add up these two right here and these two right here, these two right here, these two right here. Any way that you do it, it will equal 62 or 6 and 2. Take your word for it. <laughs> <laughs> that was dope. Thank you. Well, thank you all so much for watching today. If you like this video, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe if you have not already, so that way you can follow me in my 52-week magic challenge. If you have any suggestions for any tricks that you'd like to see me do in the future, leave them in the comment section down below. I'd love to read that stuff. Well, thank you all so much again for watching today, and I'll see you all next week with a new video. All right, bye.